In this video, I'll be taking you through a GDevelop 5 project. We'll be making a space shooter game. Uh, you can use this to create your own project or finish the project that you're working on. So first, I'm going to open GDevelop 5. And again, I'm going to start from the beginning. So if you've, if you've already done this, then you can fast forward to the part that you need to watch. So create a new project and I'm going to click empty game so I have an empty game now I want to go back to the tutorials and I want to open up space shooter so I have this in a browser and then I have my gdevelop5 open separately as you can see the the tutorial will walk you through all the steps so first we're gonna add a scene and we're gonna, gonna we're gonna call it base scene so we'll open our project manager, rename. Now we'll reset the size. So select on game settings, open the project manager, click on game settings, and we'll go to properties. And we're going to resize this to 900 by 500, I believe. And we need to rename the game to Space Shooter and click apply next we'll enable grids and we will resize the grids to 16 by 16 so you can click here uh, first you want to show the grid next you want to set up the grid and right now it's set to 32. We want to make it 16 by 16. Okay. And next we add a player. And um, we need to download the assets first. So to find the assets, go into the tutorial. Download. Unpack. All right, well, this is a good time to set up our files. So in your documents, should have a gdevelop um, project. And as you can see, these are all my projects. So I'm going to call this project Space Shooter 2. Now I want to put this assets folder. See, I have space shooter assets. Now let's fix the player. So add animation, add, and we need to go to that assets folder. And wrong, wrong one. Remember, I did space shooter two here are my assets and now I need to find the player open and apply so now I have my player I can drag him here onto the onto the scene 